number 110 is a 2011 Tiffin Allegro open road with only 39,762 miles. This vehicle has a rebuilt title. This is a high-end motorhome, which I'm doing this video over again because there was no keys and I found the keys and I was able to get it started. The drive shaft has been disconnected. It was towed in here, so it needs to be towed out of here. Don't think you're gonna connect the drive shaft and drive it away. You're gonna have to tow it out of here. The vehicle looks nice outside. The paint looks good. The graphics look nice. The rims are nice. The tires are good. Um, it has an on-on generator, 7,000 watts. I can't tell you if that works. I can only tell you that the motor sounds good. It's got 39,000 miles and the AC on the engine working. It's working great. When I turned it on, it blew out a whole bunch of stuff through the vents. So this was confiscated at a campground. So I, I, I thought the motor was going to be good and I was right. So I got it started with the jump box. It's got a V10 gasoline engine. It started right up. So the outside looks great. No doubt, it looks good. Very nice. It's got a lot of compartments. Let me show you the engine first before I proceed with the vehicle. With the, with the vehicle, yeah. All right, the motor sounds great. Here's my jump box. The battery was dead. I'm gonna leave it running for a while to see if it picks up a charge, but it probably won't. But remember, you gotta tow it out of here regardless. So you're not driving this, all right? Uh, it has a rebuilt title from California also and I don't know I think it was California only but it had a rebuilt title and the inside I'm gonna tell you right now the inside is in rough rough shape okay there's water getting inside there's the, the, the fabric I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you it's in bad shape inside but the outside looks good you can tell this is a high-end build because underneath you see the doors the compartment doors for storage lots of storage Okay, lots of storage. Now, you got the, the Michelin wheels, they look good. The tires and wheels look good. Uh, here you got your connections. I'm gonna show you the generator. It's right here. It's an Onan 7000 watt Cummings. So that means it's probably a diesel. All right. And, uh, and more compartments in the back. Look at that. The back is nice. It's got that European look with the no bumper. Very nice condition. It's got a rear view camera up there. It is built by Tiffin. Okay, it's called the Allegro Open Road. It's got a nice ladder to go on the roof. I'm going to see if I can take some pictures up there. Uh, let me show you the underneath. There's a spiders here. Uh, you see? All right, let me show you the other side. The other side looks just as good as this side. I believe this comes out. This is an extendable living area. That panel right there, you see it's overlapping the other. So this side comes out as well. You see, on both sides you have this type of paneling. So, and it's got the awning on top. So that awning is there for the parts that do extend out to protect if it does rain or anything to protect the mechanics of it all right the motor sounds great listen all right so here's another awning this is the big one this is the one that extends all the way out and you can put your picnic chairs and table and hang out here it's a pretty big one i would say it's like 15 20 feet it goes from here all the way more than halfway of the bus the bus is 33 okay so now you see there's more compartments here more storage nice this is the kitchen this area is right here you see the exhaust for the fumes and all that this is the kitchen area which extends out as well and then the master bedroom is all the way in the back you see and that extends out as well Look, more storage spaces. I'm telling you, this thing is full of storage. That's the difference between quality 
and the ones that are cheap this is not a cheap one all right so the back looks great all right so i'm gonna take you inside brace yourself i should be wearing a hazmat suit this bee's driving me crazy okay going inside here we go as you can see it's all deteriorated from the rain damage and uh, the ceiling is messed up this recliner does not belong there it was placed there remember this was confiscated so the police department went through it thoroughly looking for whatever they were looking for you see everything is open everything is thrown every all over the place i don't know if the guy was or the person who owned this was a disaster and it was like this before but i know that usually police departments open all the compartments you see everything is open so let me show you what i see this driver's seat is the fabric is gone the motor's running it sounds good the ac is blowing cold it's got the t wide lcd monitor there for the backing up and on the side you got cameras you got a jvc radio it's got the uh, abs light on it's got 39,762 the AC is blowing ice cold. The nice thing about this unit as well, it's got an entrance for the driver and an exit. That shows another quality build. Usually they don't have that. So look at the roof. The ceiling is gone. It, it's all, the cabinet's okay. The wood looks all right. But I see here, look at this. Oh, watch out. I gotta watch where I step. You see that? That's rotted, rotted wood, okay? So, and that's the part, that's the kitchen area right there that extends outward. It's got a granite tops. It's got the gas stove. Uh, you can see the master bedroom back there. You see, there's a mirror back there. I see myself. You see the master bedroom? The door is halfway closed. So it must have a bathroom and must... I'm not going back there. I'm sorry. I love what I do, but ah, not that much. I can't risk it for that. I, you never know. You bet you come in here with gloves and a mask because I saw roaches in here. So I saw a couple of roaches in here. So this really needs to be gutted out and redone. And uh, I believe this section here may extend outward. Don't hold me to it. Usually when you see that height difference there, that means it does. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it does. Oh, yes, it does. Look right here. Here's the window. So you got double sided out extenders. You got a bigger living area over here. You got a bigger kitchen area over there. And you have more room in the middle. So, but um, that's all I can say. You see, you, you have an idea. I'm sure it's very nice. It was nice when it was new, but now it's in rough shape in here. And the exterior looks good. All right, I'm gonna turn it off. AC's blowing cold, motor sounds good. I'll, I'll rev it up for you. Hold on. I don't wanna to touch anything here. Okay. See the RPM gauge here? Motor sounds fantastic. That motor will take you everywhere. Anywhere. And a good thing it's gasoline now because diesel's so expensive right now. It's cheaper way to go with gas. It's a V10. All right, let me see if I can show you anything else. It may not be as bad as it looks because it's all messed up, but uh, it does need work. All right, it does need a lot of work. All right, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna get on top of the roof and take some still photos. And, uh, and that's it, I don't know what else to show you. Good luck.